Hey everybody, welcome back to Kill by Daylight. Um, so it looks like it's it's some pretty sad news on the Springtrap and DVD front. It looks like that dream is dead. Because uh, as of today, yeah, you can see down, you can see down right here. Right there, boom. Again, doing these desktop videos. Very weird, you see everything. I'm not sure if I'm into it. Or if I'm too into it. I don't know which one yet. Uh, but as of... Uh, August 12th, 2021. Thursday, August 12th, 2021. Sorry. Thank you, Windows. Um, also, rain is coming. Gross on who? Uh, 1039. Why do I keep making that joke? I don't know why. Uh, 1039 p.m. Uh, time of death for the spring trap and DVD movement. Uh, because um, it looks like Pinhead is the next killer entering the realm. You see the. You see the. You know. How, we, how DVD leaks found this one out. You should be, you should have been looking at some, uh, the FNAF stuff, because that was brilliant, what you did here with the spectrogram. Absolutely brilliant, if you can't see it. There you go. Boom, I outlined it. See, H-E double hockey hells. Um, at hell, you got an R, you got an A. This is, uh, the circus. I, it's an I, it's right there. Uh, then you got an S. And this one was, this one took me forever to find it. Um, it is right here. It's an E. Why am I not drawing on the thing I want to draw on? Make me angry. So angry. There's an E right there. Boom. Look at that. Shh. Look at that. Look at this right there. Also, um, that's not in the game. That's in, that's a thing that's not in that map on, on any map, actually. Yet, here we are. But it looks like uh, Pinhead is uh, coming to the realm uh, relatively soon, uh, if my calculation is uh, all foretold. And by foretold, I mean by DVD leaks. Uh, it's about five days from now. Um, in fact, we're actually missing one more clue here. The R-A-I-S-E. Uh, it's not Hellraiser. It's not some weird French, French pronunciation of Raiser. Uh, so we're missing an R unless they did they did tweet out something uh, from DVD mobile Where they uh, put RT as in retweet, but they actually put it in the retweet It was weird. It's a rookie mistake on behaviors part uh, But then they followed up like here's our thing and it was red herring. So maybe R from that but ugh, uh, it's, the red herring probably is reference to the, that tweet itself. Um, but yeah, he's gonna, he's, he, he's, Pinhead's gonna be in Dead by Daylight, looks like. Five days from now, PTB will just drop randomly. Uh, he, it's cool. He fits. He absolutely fits the aesthetic. So, uh, that's a good choice, getting it before, uh, Clive Barker gets his hands back on his, uh, his property at the end of the year. Um, am I disappointed it's not Springtrap? Yeah, but, you know, there's always the sixth anniversary event where they reveal Freddy, Bonnie, Chica, Foxy, Springtrap, and uh, Balloon Boy as separate individual killers. That'll be that'll be really uh, pants soilingly awesome. Um, if I don't seem like excited for Pinhead, uh, it's because out of all the the classic horror movies, Hellraiser is the one that I actually haven't seen like ever. Like, I've seen Friday the 13th, I've seen Nightmare on Elm Street, Texas Chainsaw Massacre, Halloween, uh, Candyman, Scream, Child's Play, Saw, I've seen a lot of them. All, most of those, actually all of them, with the exception of, uh, F-13, uh, are all in Dead by Daylight. That's weird how that works. Uh, and Candyman. Candyman's probably never making it in, so, uh, sad day for that one as well. RIP, I guess. Uh, it's now or never. That movie comes out in, like, a few weeks from now, I uh, I just, I don't know. They're, they didn't pull the trigger on Candyman, which is which is odd. Um, I never thought Hellraiser would make it in. To be fair, so I was like, hey, oh, it's, if if one Clive Barker thing makes it, in, it's probably gonna be Candyman. No, apparently not. It's Pinhead. Um, but yeah, uh, I've never seen Hellraiser. It was one of those movies that uh, I was actually like too scared to watch as a prepubescent thirteen-year-old when I first got into horror movies. Like, it's, it's just, it's like, oh, that's, that's weird, man. That looks gross. What the hell is this movie? I watched Saw at, like, 13, and, and, like I said, Texas Chainsaw Massacre was years later. 
but like Halloween, Friday the Thirteenth, Nightmare on Elm Street, like I said. And Hellraiser was the one who was like, ah, even Candyman was like, ah, bees in the mouth. That's fucked up. But okay, whatever. I'm down, I guess. Um, never watched Hellraiser. Uh, I guess if if he does get announced officially, or like I said, dropped into the PTB unceremoniously, I guess is more likely what's gonna happen. I'll have to sit down and watch the first Hellraiser. Um, I know the first two Hellraisers are owned by the same company, which that's the version we'll probably get because that's how behavior roll behavior. I put a B in there where it didn't belong. Behavior. Uh, roll that way, they just go after the first movie, or the first two movies, if they're owned by the same company. So I'll probably get that, that's cool. Um, and we'll probably get another... What do you call it? Xenobites. Xenobites, I know that for a fact. Um, that'll probably be the legendary skin, unless... All of this is for nothing! And they're just trolling us, which is... Very, 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 very likely, because it's behavior and, um... That's what they do. Um... Yeah, it could be, it could, there's so much, there we're one letter away from just spelling out Hellraiser. We need another R, and that could be tomorrow, Friday the 13th, which they could just, they could just drop a bombshell and be like, hey, Jason Voorhees is coming. And blow all our minds, and pants away, um, but we're missing an R. So, Friday the 13th, August 13th, the day this goes up. We'll probably get the last R and or a, a teaser video. Remember when they used to drop teaser videos for killers that were coming to the game? They haven't done that since Twins. Yeah, Twins. I was gonna say Blight, but no. Twins. Twins was the last one. Yeah. And like, yeah, the... No. Did they drop one for Blight? Cause I remember just waking up one day and like, oh, Blight's Blight is a new killer on P on the PTB. They did. I know the twins one because I made a video on. I did. I did a video on the Blight, and then of course Pyramid Head. No, Pyramid Head was before that. My Pyramid Head, Blight, Twins, and then Trickster. Yes, is that the order? And then Nemesis, obviously they're not going to do something. No, they, they just straight up... No, they did do a teaser for Nemesis. It was just like, hey, it's going to be from Resident Evil, so you got, you're limited on your options. So there's that. Um, yeah, they just kind of stopped. They just like, here's Trickster. Here he is. Fort. There he is on the PTB. Go get it. Like, they, yeah, they gave us that, like, 12-second soundbite that I did a 15-minute video on because I'm good at that shit. Look, it's at timer 845. 846, 47, counting the seconds of this video. Um, but, like, at this point, we're one letter away, like I said, from spelling Hellraiser and just being like, it's Pinhead. Hey, actually, look. Remember that? That's a Pinhead. That's not in the game, so... There's that, but like I said, it's behavior. They could do anything right now. Um, at this point, though, I, I don't care who it is. It doesn't really matter. They've pulled us in so many directions with these teasers. Like, hey... It could be Springtrap. Oh, hey, two clowns. That's Pennywise. Um, also in this cage. I don't know if you can see it in this picture. Um, that's an ace. Uh, what? Which one is it? This one? There it is. That's an ace Visconti in a cage. Despite all my rage, I'm still an ace in a cage. Um, but I don't know why. Um... But yeah, they, they've, it could be Springtrap. Oh man, Pennywise, they dropped a thing for patch 5.1.1 where it was like, oh yeah, it's hatching today and everyone went, egg, wait a minute, alien? So, like, they've pulled us so many different ways. I, I, I just don't care who it is at this point. I just care if, if they're fun. If they play well, they're not buggy, nemesis, or uh, underpowered. Trickster, uh, break the the entire game in the server so nobody could play it. Twins are buggy mess, blight. Um, Pyramid Head was pretty good. 
Yeah. Um, so I, I just want them to be fun. I just want them to be fun. I want, if it's Pinhead, if it is Pinhead, good, that's great, man. Like I said, he fits. He f absolutely fits. The dude looks fucking crazy. I haven't seen the movie yet. I'm gonna have to do it, like, a as soon as this is done rendering. But, he absolutely fits, so that's great. He's in it. That's fucking dope, man. Hope it's another humanoid. So there's that. We could add a mechanical robot, Springtrap. We got another non-human in in uh, Alien. We got another fucking space clown in Pennywise, or a demonic ghost in Candyman. But you know, de humanoid demon. I guess Candyman is a humanoid demon, and Pennywise is technically a humanoid. Kinda. It's kind of humanoid. Um, like I want. I want other things. Like, we're gonna get a vampire eventually, it looks like. That's gonna be not human. Werewolf? That's a human that turns into a bipedal dog. Still human. I want some monsters, man. I want movie monsters. Creature from the Black Fucking Lagoon, goddammit. Give me that guy. He's fucking crazy. Yeah. It, he, like I said, he fits. Pinhead fits. Um, I will say. I will say one thing as a negative. My PC needs update. I'll say two things that are negative. Um. If it is Pinhead, uh, it's pretty bad timing because uh, Rick and Morty, I think their second episode of the season, just took the piss out of the entire Hellraiser franchise. Your suffering will be our pleasure. If you love something, don't you, isn't that a good feeling? Our pleasure is pain. But then if you hate it, you love it again. Pain feels so good. So if it's a good feeling, don't you hate that? Because hurting is bad, which is good. Like, that whole thing. Holy shit. I'll probably intersplice a, a clip of their explaining it, Dan Harmon explaining it, but holy shit. He's... He just fucking nails that thing to a wall. Um, yeah. I'm actually kind of glad it's not Springtrap or Alien. Kind of glad, because I, like, I'm trying to... We're on the cusp of this new chapter, so I gotta think of a new killer domain for the next... Uh, Killer Main series, which videos are coming back fairly soon. Really soon, actually. Probably the next video after this one. Unless there's some fucking weird ass twist in this plot. Uh, the next video after this one will be gameplay and it'll be another pig video. But I gotta I gotta pick who I wanna main, and I'm like, if it's Springtrap, that throws a fucking wrench into everything, because I'll main Springtrap. Or I'll main the Xenomorph. Pinhead, I was like, ah. Take him or leave him at this point. Cool that he's coming, maybe. Gross. Second time I made that joke in this episode. Why? Why me? Ask myself that every day. Um, as long as he plays one non-buggy and doesn't crash the entire fucking server, um, his ability is cool and good. He's a good killer and um, his perks are useful all around. I would love for Hellraiser Pinhead to come to this game. He's probably gonna be called the Hellraiser, right? For one, that's a dope ass name. Uh, <laughs> so I'm just rambling at this point. Um, but my, the ideally, he would come with three perks that are all meta changing for killers. That would be cool. Because uh, from what I understand, that hasn't fucking happened in like two years. That would be neat if we get like. Something that just shakes the fucking meta. And survivors have to actually think what they're doing and think out their process and not just gen rush and open a gate. That'd be fucking cool. And it'd be really cool if behavior didn't immediately neuter that shit. Like two weeks out. That'd be really dope. So, um, like I said, next video is going to be back to the gameplay. We're getting back to the, uh, Becoming a killer main shit. We're gonna get back. We're absolutely gonna get back to the uh, what the hell do I call it? The adapt challenge. We're trying to get all the killer adapt achievements. Uh, and then the let's kill with uh series is coming back. Where it's all coming back. And then uh, if he drops the PTB drops Tuesday. This is coming Tuesday. I'll do a video going over his perks and his power, and maybe a mini review of what I thought of the movie. That'd be neat. Um, but until then, I want to thank you all for watching. If you uh, have any ideas about this, or, well, this is going to go up like 6 p.m. Friday the 13th. Knock on wood. 
nothing I don't get kicked in the drop kicked in the crotch by Murphy's Law uh, this will be up at 6 p.m. that uh, tomorrow Friday when you're watching it currently uh, it'll be in the future yep uh, we might have some hard evidence of like that it is pinhead and like I said it might be a teaser if they drop a teaser I'll give a reaction to that so either it's gonna be a gameplay video or it's gonna be a fucking reaction to the teaser either way something's happening I guess I'm out of I'm running out of my mind um yeah what are you what are your thoughts on uh, pinhead coming to the dead by daylight I can't leave a gap between this person coming and then something else cuz then it sounds very bad and then YouTube's like don't what the fuck do you say who's doing what to who um what are your thoughts on uh on, on all uh uh can't call him ph pyramid head pinhead pyramid head we got two heads in this game man oh five, uh, three technically meg head she counts um yeah what are your thoughts on him him uh him arriving to the realm uh i'm curious what the lore is gonna be because uh, he is a demon from what i understand that could be really uh interesting something like uh Something like Freddy. Um, this is another 15 goddamn minute video. Uh, yeah. Thank you all for watching. Uh, and until next time, I will see you in the fog. Goodbye. <laughs>